So yeah. we just sold our truck at Carmart in Car Fort, Pierce. Fort Pierce. Victoria. We went, to four, we went to four dealerships total. Yes. Best price, best service. Anyway, <laughs> truck is gone. Today is Friday. So boats needs a little few more things that we're going to try to leave tomorrow yeah. and head for the coast. That's true. Right? Yep. All right. Thanks, Victoria. Of course. Thank you. Thank you, guys. <laughs> How are you feeling about this? Uh, glad to get some fresh diesel in there. Yeah. 20 gallons in the tank. Um, I, put some, I put some treatment in there. Obviously this has been sitting for a while. Mm -hmm. And then th the main reason I want this isn't so much to, it, for running out of gas, but if we had to um, change rake cores, mm -hmm. uh, which is going to be definitely possible, mm -hmm. we need to be able to top off the rake core filter or else we're going to suck in there and have to bleed the system. Yeah. I'm unable to. The sun is literally at the at the the point of the mast is where the sun is. I just. Oh yeah, I did. Pay attention to that. Is what you're telling me? Look at that. Oh my god, that's so deceiving. Holy triples. Oh my god. What just happened? Yeah. Look at this. That is disturbing. It just happened again. It seems like it's like you inches. It's that. Oh my god. And there's the sun again. Alright, hopefully you, everyone can hear over the engine, but uh, we didn't film a lot at the marina. It was pretty chaotic. We uh, made it to the dock, the fuel dock. Actually, Oh, oh yes we, okay yeah we actually we pulled into there perfectly <laughs> um anyway we're moving down the canal now headed out um just kind of getting used to getting down the road here i was going over the stuff with juliet we got a navionics running on the ipad and then a, a chart plotter i kind of got them both running right now um getting used to both of those um boat moves along i mean we're probably doing i don't know 1800 rpms moving along at six and a half knots pretty easily um how does it feel driving it? Nice. How does it feel to be out of the marina and actually on the water? <laughs> um, there was like a moment where it just like hit. <laughs> there was a moment where it just hit. So that was like, oh snap, like it's real now. Yeah. And so letting that sink in is nice. That's kind of cool. That's hey. good. The, he's, boundaries. No, well, he, <laughs> he's <laughs> determined to fall in the water, like, he, uh, well, uh, absolutely determined to fall in the water. Man. And, yeah, so, hey, hey, dude, he's, like, hanging off the side. Anyway. Yeah, yeah keep it on the edge the entire time. Do, do you see, Br Bronson? <laughs> Anyway. This is some weather right here. It might rain. Yeah, if it does, we'll put the uh, the windshield down and, and do that. But we opened the windshield up to, to get the air. It actually feels really good in here. It feels wonderful. And honestly, down below, it doesn't feel bad either. It's not no. bad at all. No. It moving like this, so. But they're kind of chilling. I'll take a walk up the front and check, check everything. Oh. Filled up with diesel. This is kind of... I know this is not good. We just kind of temporarily rigged this just because we're motoring down the canal. Um, I got to find a better way to rig this and strap this in so it's secured. Um, but uh, other than that, everything's running good. Everything's running smooth. Nice houses over here. Yeah.
Okay. They will be lying to their first install sailboat. The sailing vessel spike again. You know <laughs> Just, just yeah, hold it there. Yeah. Can you push off, push us off the wall a little bit? Okay. He said, "Get off the wall." I don't know what the fuck he wants me to do. See if you can just with the with the pole, babe. Just keep us like. Off the wall, but but not drifting. Is that possible? Okay, I'm gonna go forward a little bit. I'm gonna go forward just a little bit. I, I mean, I'm just drifting. Now I'm drifting like out to sea though, you know? All right, Kevin, what are we doing right now? We try to make it to the St. Lucie lock with no real help. Oh. So, there's Kevin and his new best friend. They're, they're, Give his uh, communication they're, skills they're, a zero. Oh. And his personality a double zero. You heard what I said. You gotta communicate with the people. They're operating a 20,000 pound sailboat trying to come up here and you gotta tell them what to do. Beautiful. <laughs> All the reviews on like Nagatics are like, oh, they're great, it's great. That, I, didn't, I don't find that to be great. I feel like we might figure out what bad is, so. <laughs> and some of these. I told them on the radio, it's the first time coming through here, so why don't you give me some guidance? Oh. You know? We're, we're on the wall, totally fine. No, we were totally fine on the wall. Get off the wall. Now I'm sitting here and having to do three point turns for 15 minutes in a, in a sailboat. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with being on that wall. <laughs> 369 point turns. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Yeah, you better pay attention to right there. Bronson just took a giant crap on the uh, bow of the boat. Did he? Which, oddly enough, I guess is a good thing. Oh my god. Uh, in an alternate world of I know, it's a, hell, it's a, it's a, it's a positive thing. There you go, babe. So, that might be the best thing that happened to me all day is him taking a giant crap on, on the bow of this boat. Expensive. My expensive, expensive house, floating house. My expensive yacht. He pooped all over it, yeah. I gotta go clean it up. It's getting real nice and cool outside though. Okay. Yeah. I tried to put I put like a rope uh, that thing is kind of banging around with, with, with these weights, but yeah. oh, all right. <sighs> we survived the day. Mm -hmm. That was rough. Yeah. That was a lot. Well, I mean overall it went actually pretty smooth at that. I, I mean we've already discussed this. We're not, you know, hiding it. The the, the dogs made it extremely and people are going to be like 
Oh, I told you. But, well, you didn't tell me. I already knew it'd be brutal, so I already know you that. You just know the actual flavor now. Like, we didn't know what level of brutality, and so now we know exactly, and we're still learning. We hit every, every cut it, it makes every, everything more difficult by far, um, so... Like, like I said, you, you can say, you know, I told you so, but you didn't tell me. I already, I, uh, oh. I beat you to it. I already knew that. So. Oh, you told me. I just voluntarily do brutal things. So. Spinning. Oh, wow. oh man! <laughs> Everyone just completely did like a what it was like a one eighty. Oh, no, it was a full three sixty. A full three sixty. Yeah. The wind's just like whipping around. Yeah. Everyone's spinning it in the anchorage. No, it was... Yeah, look at the new boat that just pulled in. Look at he's look at he's sliding. Sorry, we did a one eighty. Okay, I'm yeah. Sorry, you're right. <laughs> yeah, everyone just spun. It was going that way, and now I just came this way. And that's Scott's over there getting it. It's a bad time to be rowing. He's probably just lashing it down. Yeah, look at look at how everyone's boating except for that one boat right there. He's, he's, he's opposite of everybody because he's all twisted up in his in his snubber. Everyone else is pointed the same direction except that guy, that one. That happened the other day. He was all up on that other other boat. No, nobody's on either one of them now. Usually he's okay, but when the wind whips up, he gets all sideways. Look how I mean. Look how far away from him we are now. Before we were like right next to him. It's also because it, well, it's also because we have enough scope out. I don't think he's got very much scope out. He, he's just. Doing his parameter checks. Look, the catamaran is like into the channel almost. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Temperature yeah. dropped. I know. Oh, he could feel it. Look, he's backing up. Oh, is he dragging? Yeah. No, he, no, no. no he, yeah, he is. He's dragging big time. I think. No, 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 no. His anchor's down. Look how he went. But I thought he motored. He's out there. Oh, he's out 
is very grateful we have our anchor. I feel like yeah. that was a solid decision. No, that was a conversation. That was a, that was a real conversation. At this moment in time, I'm not saying to myself, I wish I had a smaller, lighter weight anchor. <laughs> I feel like we made a really good decision with that, all of that Stop. whole strategy. Did he just swing or did he actually drag? Or did he, did he just swing? No, I think he purposely, I think his motor is on. It, I think his, he purposely was pulling back. Why would he do I that? I watched him do it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I, he's in the cockpit because he's dragging. I think he's trying to like oh. solve the problem. Like, if he if he was holding, there'd be no reason to move. Hey, look, the catamaran's dragging too. Unless they released their shit, I I, I don't know. Why would they have released it though? Everybody's <laughs> popping their heads up. <laughs> I don't think you saw it. Yeah, we're all like. <laughs> yeah. He must be. He's dragging good. I know. Like, there's only so much further you can go, sir. I'm gonna text Scott and say I'm, enjo- I'm enjoying that upgraded anchor right right now. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, he better do something. He's gonna hit the wall over there. They don't seem too uh, concerned with it, but. I feel like they got those. I don't think we're to that point yet, but if it gets bad enough, I'm, we might have to raise the dinghies uh, at an angle and pull the plug on the back so it doesn't fill up with water. I don't, I don't think, you know, I don't think we're there yet. Well, let's just chill before, for, well, we're there yet. this cut could pass pretty quick and it, you know, we'll, we'll keep checking it, but. How's it look? Okay. Well, what I mean is actually lift it up so it drains out the. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, okay, gotcha. Good, good, good. Okay. I think we're good now on them, but. If we were to go down for the night, though, I would cinch that up probably tighter. Yeah. I'm not seeing it, 